What's up everyone? White Rose Demon here, back with another episode of Bunker Survival. Last episode we started up with... We ended up doing some upgrades to our storage. And I think it turned out pretty well, but I think at some point I want to change these over. But that that's not today's episode. Today's episode is cleaning up our hub. We have three possible things. We can build ourselves a under... We can... Uh, now let's see. I know for a fact we have elevators. Zone planner? No, uh... I think that's what I need. Okay, uh, we'll fix this. So, I need... Okay, I can easily make this. I just... And, of course. The one thing we need that uh, we don't have... Enderman, any light level. Spawn biome, exp yeah, okay, okay, uh, let's see, what, let's see, let's see. So I think today, uh, don't, yeah, I still haven't done anything. We got three epic, we got some nice epic bacon, but we want to save that for really good bit snacks. So what I'm going to do is, I know I'm going to get a lot of people not too happy about me for doing this. Wait. It's a stone pickaxe. Oh, wait, uh. I need this because I need to come over and around like so because we're digging down like this I want to box it off like this. I also need a uh, transfer node. Okay, I might not have any laying around. That's the thing. Yeah, don't seem I have any laying around. So for now, uh, we'll move up, move the crafting. I want to keep the crafting table right here in the center. That's the thing. So uh, well for now, let's just place that there. Wait a minute. Wait. That's what I was gonna do. I just did it wrong. Good thing we uh, did that. So let's uh, pop these out. It might cause a bit of a delay on the power system, but we'll put that there and.
because I want a fair bit of a... Or do we want to do that now? Uh, given these are only temporary... Let's balance the grid. And collect. Okay, uh... Now we add in our uh, ladders going all the way up. I forgot they had these uh, speedy uh, speed upgrade things for. with the ladders. Okay. Okay, so this is essentially gonna be our power floor, so to say. Oh, right now anyway, it's gonna be our floor for power. So I'm just going to box out this area. Like so. So this is kind of the floor where our main productions are going to be. We're a little under, so I think what I'm going to do. The original plan was to have this be like a walk up up a walkway, but I think what we're going to do is we're going to have this be like a nature section here for our animals. That we raise. We have different levels, so this level might be for our animals storage and. Uh, farming setups and then up there up the next level will be life style so like living quarters and down here will be like power and production so now that's the thing actually uh is this too low oh, 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 too shallow of a difference Because we still have our Ivor Hammer. So I want to dig out this way. Uh, go every three blocks. Starting on the second. And ending here. So it's three, six, so it's a nine by nine room. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And now I want to raise it up by so that we can get because this is going to be our mop farm well that's the thing once we make a mob farm it's going to be one of those things we do not move and for the time being we do have to light it up because we're actually going to be using a different method for mo farming the mobs. Because I think we can do the mob crusher or
Uh, mob duper, mob, mob detector, mob imprisonment tool, golden spikes. Yeah, that requires us to make some diamonds. Yeah, drop of evil, right click. Mm. Industrial forging, gold gear, and a lot of swords. Uh, this is probably a more effective thing to make. But in order to make that, we need a fertile. machine frame yeah so let's go make that so that we can then get ourselves some gear up and running so we need tin iron uh, okay we, we have gold mm. Do we have other gold laying around? Yes. We also need redstone, which should be around here somewhere, shouldn't it? Or did I use all my redstone? Well, uh, let's smelt up the tin. Oh yeah, we got we we got a fair bit of bread. So, in order to make the slaughtering plant, oh, we need two iron swords. Why, why is it... Machine casing? Ah. We have four different... Uh, things we can make. Wait, do we have any machine casings laying around? Because you never, I, you never really know with me. I could have like any of these items already ready to go with machine casings, just from crafting of random stuff. Post no. Nope. Yeah, I think our best choice is pro. Hmm. Queen of Infinity. Uh, let's throw all this cobble down. More iron laying around. Always good to double check just to make sure. Iron bars. So let's grab a simple machine casing. Make one of those. We need two sticks. And we also need to make. Okay. So we need another simple machine. And um, we are missing the grain of infinity. Which should have a, another one around here somewhere. Yeah.
Ooh, uh, right, we have this here was running, so we can make up some iron and just go from there. Yeah, because we have a more than infinite supply of uh, energy by the looks of it. Yeah, we need two redstone. And there we go. Okay, so... Okay, so we need about two stone gears. Do we have any just normal stone laying around? Not me, I probably do, but I don't know where I have it. So let's grab some of our mass amounts of cobble. And just bring it over and let's pop that in there here. And just throw that all in there to cook up. Yeah, we're not too uh, blessed on iron, are we? Ooh, oh, wait, uh. I think we need to make two furnaces. And I think if we come back over here, yes. Next, when provided with power, water, and latex. But how do we get the uh, latex? Okay, that's actually fairly easy to get.
Uh, I need a okay. Uh, stone level pickaxe will work. So we throw that stuff in there. There we go. Uh, now we throw this dirt in here. We throw some of uh, the, the bread here and this, this. Okay. So if I'm not mistaken, I think we need to put that... Uh, Like that. Then place a wood block right there. And yes, it fills up with the... Uh, Okay, I honestly don't know. Uh, let's grab the bucket. Actually, uh, so I don't need energy. It, it just collects. Yeah, so it seems that this is all going to be automated. going to have to be manual for the time being. Uh, let's get rid of the dirt in our inventory and the wood. Let's grab that back. Oops. Uh, I could have sworn I had like a couple dozen buckets. What happened to them? Or did I use them in crafting again? Without remembering that, no, okay, here we go. Now that should give us a latex. I think if I put that in there. So we need about uh, 18 or so. Okay, we're out of water. So what I might do is... Uh, let's take that, this, and these and come over to our farming area but it's surprisingly a lot easier to make a uh, right there uh, actually I think we should just be able to take this latex processing unit pop that up there that should be yes okay so it's putting water in here constantly that is actually a good thing now if we uh, come over here, pop up here
Now, let's see, do we have any fluid uh, transport things left thing around? Uh, we probably do. Or did I use them all when I was uh, making stuff? Uh, let's hope that we have some... Uh, okay, yeah, we need to collect this stuff and just unload it into one of the chests. Again, this is uh, one of our biggest concerns. Storage is always going to be an issue until we get a decent system set up. Uh, transfer nodes for fluid. Well, luckily, oh right, uh, our sand should be like right here. We can throw that in there, make up some glass. Now we craft, craft up one of these. Lay it out like so. Once, uh, let's see. Yes, we got enough for one more redstone. We're gonna have to hope for... Now we need a fluids transfer node and we need a sec... Uh. Okay, so now we need to make a fluid transfer node. And now if we come back over here, we have to dig a little space here behind this. At some point I think we will need to make a secondary pump. Oh right, uh, this isn't connected to power, is it? So, let's come up the back here. And connect this thing to power. Okay, it's surprising. It actually is keeping up rather nicely. So, it seems we have a fair supply of uh, plastic now. Tiny dry rubber. Uh, I think we need two more. So now... We'll go over and... Ha like, the wheat is not a big deal anymore. So, uh... We are making, we were making this. Wait. What one were we, what was the thing, oh. Uh. Okay, uh... So we need a cow. Which we get from... Cows. But how do we make cows? Cow bait is... Oh, okay. So, uh, I think we're gonna make cow bait today. 
Or at least that's going to be what we work on now. And I remember that we can do that. So I think I want two cows. So let's take cow bait and just uh, You want water? I'll give you water, cows. So it seems the crusher is what we need, which is kind of a letdown considering we made all this gear. But now that means that we can start collecting. So, so we have 30 seconds until uh, that, but I'm going to come over here to hopefully get that second cow. I was did not really think it would be this easy to get a cow. Oh no. Well, I guess it's a good thing we made a sword then. I say it came from over here and moved it with it. This we're going to turn this into curse at use the mob crusher to kind of force the mobs into the area. Uh, where's the... Uh, nice, we got a cow. Which should give us milk now. Oh, uh. Uh. Well, I know for a fact that right here works for getting cow, so... Let's move right here and just watch for a cow. Hmm. And we got an adult cow. Nice. Uh. Okay, that don't work. Uh. Okay, so let's grab bone meal. Okay, so we can breed up some cows now. Now, I know it's not going to be the nicest thing that we do right now is... Ooh, uh... Ooh, uh, side cows. So I'm going to get us another cow kind of uh, help out here because we need at least two so nice so hopefully now this will let us uh, can't breed ah uh, great how long till this one is grown uh Let's go grab some sugar cane. Make some book a book.
Oh wait, uh Well we cows we got now. So we need a mob crusher. We need two gold gears, uh how much gold did we get from this? Not much. Not much indeed. Uh, more gold there. What's the what's our um, berries looking like? Dang. Then again, uh we might be able to do Oh, I did it wrong. Mm. I think our best choice is probably, uh, hmm. So we have no other gold laying around, do we? Oh, so we do have a good... We have a lot of iron laying left to cook up. So I think for the rest of the episode, uh, in terms of uh, cooking stuff up, I'm gonna put all this in the cook up in our furnace. Okay, so this guy can't breed for, can't go at it for another bit. Uh, let's think, let's think, let's think. Hmm. How do we get gold? What's a good way of getting gold? Well, yeah, all I need is another one ore berry and our growth for these are pretty high let's see what else is, can we do mm. Yeah, they drop from piglings. We don't currently have access to that. I'm not the sharpest here th th that time. I don't want to hit the sm little cows. So... Ugh, no leather. That's kind of annoying. Uh, luckily, I think I can just go over and grab a ton of stuff from... A g a
Okay, the two cows are here. We do not question our needs. So now the only thing left for to make a mob crusher is the gold gears. Oh yeah, right, uh... Mm -hmm. Let's see, let's see, let's see... Yeah... So we need gold gears! In order to get this, uh, okay. Well, that's working. Uh, vector plates slowly pushes mob in the direction it points. Sneaking mobs are not affected. Dark sugar. With it, okay. So we need a. S How the heck do we get a slime? Sugar, iron, ch the only thing that is a. Water and rice dough. I knew I should have started growing rice. So I think what I will do now is come over here and swap this out for rice. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna quickly go grab a not a storage drawer. Okay, there we go. So yeah, we are gonna have to kind of set up a We need that. Uh don't need this stuff. Oh 
Well, the fun is here. Nice. I'm hoping that we get some iron. But for now... With three rice we get two dough. So that's enough to make one slime ball. Uh, okay. So let's... Uh, well, we now have an infinite water source here, so... Oh no, that's just normal rice. Rice dough... Uh... Rice... Oh! Oh wait, I got rid of the uh, ch of the, uh, the small one. Oh wow! So that was surprisingly easy to make. Now we just need the gold in order to make the uh, rest of the stuff. So if we can get about two more, enough to make two more gold ingots. Well, like even enough to make one more uh, like gold chunk. So let's just put this stuff in here like so. Uh, why I want debt for this? Uh, yeah, I think this should do it right. So we'll have it so that it all runs up up to here. But before that, we need to pop all this stuff out. Because I think it should all work the same. Same. Hopefully, when these are under on top of it. So I think if we do this.
the exact number we needed. I call that a pretty good victory. Now we just need to crush her. But if we need, but it seems like as we want to expand, uh, let's see, where is our drops of evil? That's the thing now. We do want to be careful about how we go about this. So the crusher is what we need. Okay. That's uh that's good then. Where is our gold nuggets? Yes, Mr. Cow. I know your living conditions are a little uh, barren right now. But trust me, trust me. It'll get better uh someday. Probably when we uh, move you to a more suitable chamber where you can't go getting in trouble. Just need one more piece of gold and we should be able to make our two more gold ingots. Nope. Yeah, I'm still slowly working off camera to get the last drop of a uh, or endo shard we need in order to make s that stuff. Uh, let's see if we can't get it ourselves. Nope. The diamond has the highest chance of getting it as far as we know. So I'm hoping that we can get it. And we got it. Okay. And I think we might be able to make this just in time to get it all to work. Uh, because let's, let's throw this dust in now. Because once we get this set up, uh, can we make a tinted glass? Okay, so glass and a die by the looks of it. Let's see if uh alloy smelter Okay, so it seems like we can't use this. Uh, that's annoying, but I mean, kind of a uh, 
Understandable, I suppose. So we'll just have to... So... Now let's make our gears. Okay, we now have a mob crusher. When provided with power, it will kill all entities in front of it as if the player would. So let's just check, check out the inventory for it first because right here should be where it goes. Fluid essence, okay. Mob drop output, fluid containers. Essence tank, energy, uh, okay. Simple enough, it seems. So let's just uh, pop this stuff out right here. Oh, right, uh, I need to get in there. Oops. I do not think this one true. True. Okay, so let's just mine out under here. Let's just, m yeah, let's just mine stuff out here. Actually, I think the best option here would probably be the mine up here first. For now. This is kind of why I want to well, get a flux network up and running. So that I don't have to worry about this being like construction of power being an issue. Uh, we'll place that in there. That sh it should have enough light. So now I'll come down here. We'll add the way up and down here for now. Sorry about the noise there. Uh, we'll just turn this to hostile creatures down to like 50. That way we can still kind of hear them just so that we know that they are spawning. And uh, how do we make more of these uh, basic universal cables? Okay. Steel and redstone. Uh, okay, yeah, we're able to make a couple. So that should be enough to power the stuff. Uh, do we? Where is our steel? To oh, we got two more universal cable, and we got some coal laying around. Honestly, if we don't, if we can't find our st any steel, uh, 
We should be able to make our own using the hammer. Okay, yeah, that should be enough to make the cables we need anyway. We get about eight per. So let's go down. Grab the cables and just link these up. Oops. So it should be, it should have, it <laughs> Okay, so that should be aggressively spawning mobs now. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, will it off put into a chest? No. Okay, so that's something I think I want to do right now. Bef bef uh, so we got a mob farm. So I think that's a good uh, point to for us to be at. Uh, we got energy. Uh, transfer of items. So we need more redstone. We do not have redstone. Uh, so let's throw the sand here in the crusher. And uh, let's think. Where could we put our... I know we had a ton of redstone. That's energy. Or did we use up all our uh, redstone and stuff building all these things the other day? Well, we only need two more redstone. So... Let's see if we can't get one. Come on, Dusky. Redstone is not the, uh, hot, the worst thing to get, so there we go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Keyboard is as if it's telling me this. Where did I put my stone? Uh, stone. Did I? Where did I put my stone? Okay, well I only need two stone anyway, so... Uh, pop that out. Pop two stone in. And, uh... Let's grab a bucket of lava from our... Near... Yeah, like we do not have to worry about lava. Like, fuel is no issue, but we I think I do want to make a better furnace in terms of overall, like, just for smelting everyday items. I, I, I knew it. I knew it would be the last place I look. This is for items. And let's make a... Uh, 
forge. Oh, we already had two. It's because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set that up like this. Uh, and set chests up here on the side so that they should off put into both of them. Oh, ill Watson Flash. Essence, Watson Flash, Zombie Brains, Gunpowder, Inferium. That is nice. And Bones. Oh, we even got Witches. Like the essence here. So let's grab all these loot uh, loot crates. Yeah, so this should all essentially fill up. Yeah, we're getting really nice loot here now. That should supply us with more than what we need now for items. In terms of mob drop items such as bone so we no longer need to shiv pig bait and raw salmon now let's see uh... let's open the uncommon first cow stall lux botanica resonating hey i think that's what we needed the soul sand iron chest plate iron ingot slime boots gold prismarine iron wand hey that's that's a pretty good. That just saved us a few minutes. So we'll let's throw all the Okay, let's throw everything we don't need right now off into this. Because right now I think I wanna end the episode off by opening up a another loot crate or let's go and see how much of a loot how many loot crates we got down there right now. Uncommon, common, rare, and we also grab all this experience. We are getting some nice heads, so I might do some type decoration with that. But we're getting things like spider eyes, witch, witch stuff, and experience. Wow, this gives. <gasps> Did that just uh? We're getting what I wanted. We're getting what I wanted here. So are we getting ender pearls off of this? That is honestly the whole point of me making this is to make ender pearls so that we can make an elevator going to different floors. That is kind of my goal. Mm? Okay, so I have to level almost level twenty one. So that oh okay. So we got a nice slime boots. Da -da -da. Okay, let's open up the common stuff. Uh squid bait. So that's not bad. Uh let's go open up the common or uncommon. We got iron horse armor ender pearl. Three ender pearls, nice. Now it's the rare gold eh gas tears. Uh we can make we get that from soul sand, but what can we make with it? Nimbus amulet, no uh there was an item Evil Tear, no. Uh, well, 
Right, we need that to make an ender pearl. But we can easily make th an end. Now we have ender pearls, which we can make a lot of good things with. But the thing I I wait. What's this? Oh wait, that means that we can make. Flux cores now. I know I made flux last time. We also need a block of flux to make flux point. Okay, so to make a flux core, we need an eye of ender. And I. Th yeah, we only got enough to make one. But one is all we need to make a flux plug, which allows us to take individual energy. But wait, hold on. Uh. Ooh, wait, yeah, in order to make more flux than that, we need to cook up redstone that we don't have. But I think. We should now be, uh, select the network, uh, network connect connection selection. Network selection, network settings, uh, energy units, red zone, energy units, yeah. Okay, so yeah, that might mess up the stuff here. But long term, I think that sh it should allow uh, like any excess, p like once this is full, this should start filling up and, well, th this should st fill this up. Then it should allow these to retain m the power excess once this is full. But, it has a, yeah, it can hold a lot, it seems. So, search mode? Now, uh, so right now I'm going to dis uh, just disconnect it like that. Until, basically, we get the main thing set up down below. I think that's a pretty good uh, work for today. We got a, we now have a ton of loot coming in, and loot here seen can easily be uh, pow like. Uh, I think I'm gonna turn off this thing for now because we don't need it active at the moment. And let's unload everything into this. Just transporter. We got some nice loot. I will hand it to that. There is a nice set of loot. Mana and a bottle. Not bad. So let's uh we got common, uncommon, rare, and clay loot chest. Oh, we just get clay. Uh, compressed flint block and silicon. We get polar bear bait. We get a cow halter. Sugar. Orange chicken egg. Okay. Okay, so I think that's a pretty good stopping point for us today. 
Hope you all enjoyed today's episode. If you did, make sure to hit the like and subscribe button to see the next ep get alerted for next episodes and just so show your support to the channel. Whoa. Uh I forget slime boots are fun. Okay, so hit the like and subscribe button. Show your support to the channel. And to be notified of uh, other parts of the uh, new videos. And make sure to check out the other series on the channel. Because the our, our newest one, Kingdom Survival, will be linked to this in some way later down the line. you have to wait and see about th how, that, how this the two link together. So hopefully y'all enjoyed. This is White Rose Demon signing off. <laughs> See you all next time. Later all.